Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. In this tutorial, I'm going to be explaining how to use an activity indicator in Xcode. Um, so, I'll just name this activity indicator demo. So, an activity indicator is used um, when you want to, when you know something's going to take a long time. So, for example, if you're loading a web page or you're doing a function which you know is going to take a long time then what you do is you can just add an activity indicator so you give the user some feedback so what I'm going to do to sh demo this is like first I'll add an activity indicator so I'll just put this in the middle uh, we'll just give it some constraints like that and I'll make this a large one so now let me connect this outlet activity indicator now we can go to our view controller so I'm gonna do so when the view does appear I'll make it start animating so override func view will appear and then super dog view will appear animated so when the views appear I'll make it start animating so activity indicator that is hidden equals false so it's showing and activity indicator dot start animating that's a function so when it's appeared then it starts animating and then in the view did appear func view did appear uh, super dot view did appear animated so there's a difference between view will appear and view did appear this always happens before this and this is like this happens as soon as the um, segue to that view controller happens or when the apps launch that this happens straight away but this only happens when the view is actually rendered in so when the views appeared we want to stop this dot is hidden equals false I mean is it's hidden and want to stop the animation so stop animating so in the middle of this this stop activity indicator and over here do the time consuming function so you would do the function that would take a long time here so to replicate that I'm just gonna do a sleep function so I'll do and then sleep or sleep for uh, let's make it three seconds and now let's run it so what this is going to do is this it's going to be animating when the views first appears and then after three seconds it's going to stop and then go away so that's just replicating a function that would usually happen in that time let's see what it is okay and let's wait for three seconds and it's gone we can even make it a bit more easy to see by doing print done uh, wait, I forgot. print done and I'll print start here so you can see that there's actually three seconds so once we see start in the chat we'll actually we'll count three seconds okay started and done just like that so thanks for watching guys, that's all for the activity indicator and see you tomorrow.